this is all going to be sheet rock. It's going to be one bigger wall. This door right here, uh, Mrs. J, the senior partner, came up with the concept of putting the door here. And we want to take the structure. You can see these are uh, windows up there. Uh, unfortunately, they were, um, they were, I thought they were painted over. Uh, they were broken out. But we will be replacing those windows. So the door is going to move over by about um, a door's length. And so all of a sudden, we're going to have room now for a bedside table. Probably a queen size bed. Bedside table. And then an entrance into um, the bathroom, the master bathroom, which I'm going to show you. It's on the other side of the wall. Here is the big discussion. We, we need a, um, a closet. There is a, this is where behind this wall where a tub exists. I don't think we need a tub. We don't need two tubs. The other bathroom, which I'm going to show you in a minute, um, will have a tub. And it's going to have a great tub. Um, I'm not a huge fan of tubs, so you can see why I would say, yeah, it's going to have a great tub. Whoop de do. Um, but if we walk through here, we would have a walk-in closet. The ceilings are high enough so we can have a double stack of clothing, uh, and we can have uh, drawer space, um, a nice uh, high level of drawer space. And then over here in the room, um, we, would, we would have a chest of drawers. So I think that really takes care of, um, of our needs for a closet, and then our entrance way. So this can be, our objective is to get two rooms that are on suite, but really. So here it is. I taped it off just so you can see where I would stack the washer and dryer. There is water right here. Uh, there is the side by side. So regardless, that is a lot of valuable space. Look at all the space here. I mean, it's a huge amount of space. I mean, you could you could have your own bathroom just right there. So to be able to repurpose a lot of that space into this bathroom. Um, I mean, I, I think it just makes all the sense in the world. So, okay, beep, 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 beep. Okay, you can see where that wall is gonna be. See how there's flooring right there? So that right there would be the door. Come in, this would now all be open. So all of this is now open. So when I'm standing here, I see this, okay? And this would become one of the bathrooms here. Since this wall is gone, that's where I would have a, uh, I would put the shower back there and I would have it um, glassed floor to ceiling in an, uh, glassed floor to ceiling in an L shape. So the, the door would come out this way, but you would still have an, a glass on the side there and that would make it light and airy and beautiful. Um, toilet is not my favorite. Favorite position for it, but it's not bad. My big issue here is just that um, you have the vanity and then you have the mirror. You have the vanity and you have the mirror and it's kind of weird. So I don't really, you know, it's not great, but maybe we could put, I don't know. We're gonna figure that one out later. But that, if there was a wall here Going, imagine if that shower curtain was a wall, and the entrance way, the entrance way would be right there. The entrance way would be right there, the back of the shower. And so it would be wall, and it would be a little wider, and so you would have a walk-in closet here that you would enter from the, um, from the bathroom. I mean, from, from bedroom number one. <laughs> Let's make confusing more confusing.